Hi guys, it's Ben here and we're doing something a bit different today. We're going to be trying out a new little series called Day Trip where I go to different grounds. Sometimes it will be Liverpool games, but as you can tell from my accent, I'm not from Liverpool, so I don't live there. I, I'm based in London, so you know, if I'm not going to a Liverpool game, I do go to a lot of Liverpool games, but if I'm not going there, then it will be a game in and around London most of the time. So today we're heading to Wimbledon for the Football Manager Cup uh, as they're playing Watford. So yeah, me and a couple of mates are going to head down to Wimbledon. I've never been there before. Uh, for the football so yeah it should be interesting it's mid-july the weather's not you know wonderful we're in stratford this is where i live uh some of you rec may recognize that tower that's where all the uh some of the side men live we did just we did live there before um just moved to this new place um nice balcony you can see the olympic stadium there behind me so uh when little did play west ham last season in the 4-0 win it was a lovely Lovely away game, a simple little walk home for me after a 4-0 win. Um, but yeah, today we're going to Wimbledon, excited to get back out there. Last football match I went to was the Champions League final, so you know this is a, a bit of a step down from that, but exciting nonetheless. Back out and in the sun, watch some football. Uh, there's a beer festival going on there too, so it should be a fun little day out. So yeah, Jubilee line from Stratford to Waterloo, little train to Wimbledon. Let's see how we get on. We've made it to Wimbledon. Um, there's a lot of Watford fans on there, more Watford than Wimbledon it seems. Um, just getting some cash out and about 45 minutes to kick off is a strong Watford side. Um, so you're looking forward to seeing that. A lot of the stars from Premier League last season are in action here. So going to get into the ground with about 45 minutes to spare. Hopefully grab a beer if they're available inside. I'm not sure. Uh, a burger is definitely needed. But yeah. Wasn't a great hot dog. Burnt onions, absolutely unforgivable. Five out of ten, and that's five quid as well. Curious. Oh, yes. <laughs> So nearly at half time, not a thriller here. A few chances for Watford, yes, all them. Uh, unfortunately, we're not allowed to go down the other end. That's where the away end is. So uh, looks like the second half, we're not going to see much action. But it's decent, decent little day out, you know. Uh, Ten quid to get in. Uh, so far, we're not bored. Um, eyes of success looks really good. The women and fullback really doesn't fancy playing against him. But, but uh, other than that, Aiden Capu looks looks handy. Um, yeah, just a standard pre-season game, not dissimilar to what I've seen from Liverpool so far this pre-season. Just pretty slow, pretty dominant from Watford, but not not really much to shout about. But it's a nice ground, I quite like it. Um, there's only one burger van. Uh, there's only one burger van, which is really surprising, and you have to go all the way around the other end of the ground to get there. So these boys reckon they've figured out a way we can get to the uh, other end of the ground without getting into any trouble. So we're going to walk around here. Flair man himself, Mr. Paul Brown. Pass this. Carol Sir. Marching my phone. Also on the ATM Giant for the 30th wedding anniversary of Aaron Sharon and Ray. That's right, it's my funny mate. Come on, yeah. Well, it's real man, Marcel. Why do you think ain't nobody likes to kill me? There's a West Ham man. Ain't nobody. So 
So we're one of the school within seconds of us moving seats to the other end of the ground, successfully navigating our way round to the seats, and yeah, the only action Wimbledon have had, they've scored. So yeah, didn't see much of the goal. Sod's law. Yeah, 2-0 to Wimbledon. <laughs> Uh, Commonwealth defender by Watford, and yeah, so I think we're three minutes into the second half, and we've, you know, we, we would have been perfectly positioned to see those two goals perfectly well, but yeah, we've moved over here, missing all the action. Should we go back in a minute? Might as well. <laughs> So we get a goal on this end, Ben Watson brings Watford back into it. Lovely little finish with his left foot. It's getting a bit more entertaining now. It was bobbing up for a bit in the first half, and now a few chances coming in. 2-1. Football manager cup can still go either way. So 20 minutes to go in the Football Manager Cup, still Wimbledon 2, Watford 1, Watford turning the screw, can they salvage something and at least share the trophy? There you go, it is 2 2, has been coming. Who scored that? Burgos. Burgos with the goal for 2 2. 15 minutes left. Looks like it could be a shared trophy at this rate, but yeah, it's been a good second half. Wimbledon have won it with two minutes to go. It completely gets them in a play. A few ricochets and uh, the striker just slotted in with his right foot. Looks like the Football Manager Cup is going to be Wimbledon's this year. What an upset. What a what an undeserved win as well. Need to get another one? So yeah, just walking back to the training session now after Wimbledon win the Football Manager Cup, having beaten Watford 3-2. Good second half, good game, entertaining afternoon at the end. Ten quid to get in, you can't really argue with that. Uh, good atmosphere, decent crowd, everyone seemed to enjoy it. Uh, yeah, so just walking back to the training session now. Really can't go wrong after today's game. Um, and I'm set for a night of watching Star Sixers uh, on television. That They're really enjoying that too, so uh, yeah, looking forward to that. It's been a good day, um, good day out. Pre-season football is back. Uh, can't wait to go to some more grounds this season. Uh, hopefully take quite a few more off. Looking forward to getting home. So at 7 o'clock, pizza in the oven. Just got home from the game. Uh, really enjoyed it, as I said. Five goal thriller. Uh, Wimbledon getting the upset over Watford. Good chance for me to scout out Watford ahead of uh, them playing Liverpool on the opening day of the Premier League season. That's also a game I'll be going to. So, yeah, really pleased with it. Hope you enjoyed it. If you are already a subscriber, then you know, you've probably just been watching my Liverpool stuff up to now. Let me know what you thought about this different style of video. And if you are new, welcome. Please do subscribe. Hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for making it till the end, obviously. Um, I'm a Liverpool fan, as you may have probably realised. Um, but yeah, I want to make it more friendly for you guys. I want to make this channel for everybody, not just for Liverpool fans, although obviously predominantly there will be a lot of Liverpool content because that's what I care about the most. But I want to 
start a lot of new series, this potentially being one of them. So if you have enjoyed it, please do drop a like on the video and leave a comment uh, with any feedback, any thoughts you may have, and any ground you want me to go to. Uh, I'm based in London, so it's easy for me to get to most places. So if you're, you know, if you're living in Oxford or Norwich or Barnstable or wherever, <laughs> uh, just let me know where you are. Let me know where I should go. Uh, and yeah, follow my other social medias too. It's Ben might say on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Facebook. And I'll see you next time.